Uh, I believe I didn't fully get the update. I think we do have another match. We are going directly to winners finals. Tony, we're not taking any breaks. That we are. So we saw we saw one of your losers bracket round two matchups. Great match. I'm so glad we got that on stream. Now we're gonna focus back up to the winners finals because we have a great matchup. Renegade stellar they still haven't played yet the winner of that goes into grand finals and gets a huge advantage in the grand finals the loser will have to fight their way throughout the losers bracket to get back into gf the losers bracket will still continue manny he presses on at the same time we had uh Vemzy and gold star that would have faced off or may still be facing off uh, not sure if we'll catch it either way we'll find out what happens there after winner's finals, because Tony, I, I think you can agree, winner's finals is the matchup we want to see here. This is, I guess, the battle of heaven and hell, right? You got the demon up against the man who looks like Jesus. You got Stellar Renegade coming up. And uh, lovely graphic once again. Yeah, I, I'm I need I need one of these artist drawings. Esports Arena makes something happen. Yeah. I need one. I need one Anyone. of these. You know, me, me and Shyway, or we, we we need to we need to make this happen. No more cams. No more cams. Make me it. and Shyway get the artist on it. <laughs> you gotta, as long as they make it flattering. <laughs> you gotta make, make make me. You know, it's a cartoon. Make me look, make me look good. I'll take it. Uh, either way, uh, I would appreciate whatever the artist wants to put together here, but they've done a, a great job with Stellar, with Renegade, with everyone on the cast today. Uh, it sets the precedent for the amazing matchups that, that have followed. So I, I wonder what these boys will pick as far as picks and bands here. I expect a, a Crossfire Plaza would be most likely. We've seen a lot of regret. It's really just between those three at this point. Uh, I would love to see a, a counter pick to Kali or to Truth just to surprise us at some point later. But at this point, I think because the win is so important, nobody wants to take a risk. They're going to play what's tried and true, play what they know. We'll have to find out, Tony. Plaza is going to be game number one. I just looked at it. Right. You're keeping up with the Discord. I got to do that so we can see the live updates and what they're picking and banning. But like you said, Plaza. So we got the site. We got the OS. We got the light rifle. We got the, the combo. We just saw it. It's really, you know, the, the uh, first opening strat is going to dictate a lot of how this goes. But just between Stellar and Renegade, I, I don't know who to pick here. So uh, you go first with your predictions, Tony. I won the last one. Who do you think will take this? Man, let me tell you, the way we saw Stellar playing, I feel, I feel like I'm almost crazy not to pick Stellar. But at the beginning, I picked Renegade to take this whole tournament. I got to stick with my guns. You told me to commit to something, so I'm going to stay okay. committed. Renegade wins our winners, our, I'm sorry, excuse me, our winners finals and makes it into the grand finals via the winners bracket. That's cool. You take Renegade, you take the bad guys. I'm going to go with the good guys. I'm fighting, <laughs> we're fighting for good here. I'm, I'm going to vote for Stellar. I think Stellar has it today. Stellar has looked disgusting today. He shut down everyone. He's going to shut down Renegade. This is really a battle of the Titans, though. These two players look most likely to win it today. So I can't wait to see how it goes. I'm going to take Stellar. I expect the chat to be pretty split on this one. I'm very curious to see what the chat's been predicting. Uh, by the way, you can see our, our format, our graphic uh, bracket on screen. Uh, Saiyan Frosty, unfortunately, out of this tournament. Uh, so is uh, Envor now, who just lost his series. Vemzy Goldstar have yet to play. And Manny will face off whoever wins in that matchup. And how crazy it is that we have two Cloud9 players. This is a guaranteed roster going into Infinite. Even Peng was in the chat saying he doesn't know who to root for. We have two Cloud9 yeah. players in our winner's ragged finals. Absolutely incredible. And uh, you, you, this, this, is like a movie, this is like a movie happening before our very eyes. <laughs> <laughs> it's interesting if it sets any sort of precedent for Infinite, though. I mean, the, the talent that we have on C9 is incredible, though we've got insane talent across the board. But uh, but definitely, you know, C9 looking nasty, coming into Infinite, coming off of Halo 5. Uh, what a great way to put, to tie things off with these 1v1s here, make a statement. I just, you know, I want to see him face off. I want to see him get into it, Tony. No more waiting. No more waiting indeed. And we have, and you know, we almost actually had Crossfire. It, it wasn't until the very last second where Stellar bans Crossfire and forces Renegade to pick between Plaza and Kali. And he's like, I'm, I'm going to go with Plaza, obviously. But we almost saw Crossfire game number one. Now, you know, that's what I want to see, Alex. Yeah, Crossfire is so fun. It's It it never goes to time. It's always quick and clean, right? You, you just get, you, you don't get what we got in Regret, which was actually fun too, right? Like the Regret game one, Envoy Manny, 
nobody got a kill for what four or five minutes i kind of had a fun time with that it was so ludicrous that it was exciting in its own way you know we have replays oh, actually, of it, apparently I let's uh yeah we got time? we got some replays let's let's throw let's throw it on the board we have we have some stellar replays here right both stellar renegade they've been looking nasty so i think we have replays of both players and oh this was just yeah stellar he snuck into cafe envor was also sneaking around but had no idea the man was behind him oh brutal dude Ooh. That was disgusting. I mean, Stellar just put on a clinic. It, it was incredible the plays that we were seeing out of him. And, and just, just puts the shots down. Knows and knows that Envoy is kind of a tricky player. Going to try to get out of there. Just just kept the aggression on him and never let Envoy get away. I love seeing fights in Plaza that go around S4. You got to jump on the signs. You got to be precise, uh, but also have your weapon ready when you're clambering up on these signs to you know to to lend shots in. Stellar just chasing him down. Complete shutdown. I mean, the scoreboard does show things close, though. So Envoy did answer back in a lot of situations here. But I think there was one point where Stellar really pulled away, and I think it happened now, where he just started hitting everything. Jeez, melee's coming out. We out. I hope we have some uh, some Renegade uh, uh, replays. Go, I because no Stellar looked good, but we we know the Renegade looked good as well. <laughs> Wait, was that oh, so that that was still replays i think maybe that was more stellar replay i thought for a second we jumped in uh let's yeah let's see renegade replays if we're not ready for the match just yet then i want to see what renegade's been up to he's been putting on a clinic uh you know what i take it back apparently we are going into our game i'd rather get the game i'd rather focus on what uh what matters most here and that's who takes winners and moves over to grand finals they're going to be sitting on the winner's side of the bracket the best case scenario for them because like we said tony that final 1v1 10k on the line whoever takes that final 1v1 there's enough milk happening in the game so let's not milk when we're out of it we're going yes. into game number one over shields on the map snipe rifle lr plaza pistol all the resources stellar and renegade and stellar getting shut down early renegade looking nasty as expected though i am expecting stellar to come off a of spawn and answer right back but stellar gonna need a counter strategy here he's gonna have to try to get the combo in yard or something renegade not worried about it he'll take advantage of the snipe well he can he's got plasma pistol sorry uh, uh plasma nades to work with he's got the os he's got the snipe he just needs info and we have renegade with the snipe rifle in hands going up against young the young jesus and stellar right now how do we gotta yeah. stop doing that <laughs> i mean sniper rifle in hands over shield right. has about 50 percent of it and stellar trying to go over towards uh don't go over towards yard tony oh jesus christ what a snap uh, we don't write the script tony the script writes itself okay <laughs> if, it, if yes. it just so happens that renegade is the demon and and stellar looks like you know the lord <laughs> like i don't i don't know that's just how it went like the script just wrote itself we're just following the story before us here and right now uh stellar the story is he's, his brain is uh in trauma right now he's getting shot up by this sniper he's got to bounce back four shots in the chamber for renegade who will put this to work. Stellar needs to make a miss, and so far, he's just not missing. Well, there's always been a lot of religious undertones in, in, Halo, in Halo, so I guess it's only <laughs> right that we have Renegade and Stellar going up against each other. 3-0 lead in favor of the demon right now, so it looks like evil might just prevail, but Stellar gets the first few shots on Renegade, forcing him to back down here. Three shots in the sniper, and he's not. he's so confident. He's not burning any of it. He's going to burn one in Stellar's head. The beauty of a good story is that evil tends to prevail in the beginning, but it's it's always good that comes back and, and clutches up in the end when it counts. So Stellar, I believe in it. I believe good will prevail here. And uh, still one shot in this snipe to make sure he does it. Ooh, almost hitting that for a quick scope to the head, oh, but his shots are absolutely disgusting. He's going to get the reversal kill on Renegade, holding down top mid and influencing these spawns here. Nine minutes and 39 seconds on the clock, and Stellar grabs overshield. Force the cafe spawn. OS on the body. Extra shields here just needs to find this man who is being sneaky. Uh oh, Renegade's hiding. Renegade's right beside him. Renegade. Oh, he's too far to backsmack him, but Stellar did not notice that. That was scary business right there. Renegade, he'll try to stick him, and he does get the stick, but too much health on Stellar to actually get the kill, so Stellar now ties the game. 
by the way, great stick, great, great last ditch effort by Renegade to land that sticker grenade, neutralize all of the overshield. Now we're a little bit even here, tied up at three apiece. Snipe Wife is coming up. Both players are well aware of it. This is going to be a very important pivotal battle here on top nest. Ooh, if he throws that plat, did he launch it? No, I think Renegade picked up Snipe because you can always launch the plasma, or sorry, launch the sniper with the plasma and try to mix things up that way, but. Renegade did pull Snipe. He's sneaking now below. You know Renegade's gonna... The moment he finds an angle here, Stellar's in big trouble. Stellar just trying to hold on to top mid, but a nade came in, and a cleanup with a Magnum to close it out. Stellar just not aware of the rotation at a Renegade. That is not... We have, we have almost a full minute before another overshield, so this is gonna be crazy. Oh, no. And Renegade oh. hits the body shot! Stellar coming out for the challenge! He was in midair, nowhere that he can go, and Renegade puts him down! Yeah, Stellar full committing there. Renegade taking full advantage. Two kill advantage now for him. Six shots in this snipe. Make it five. Stellar, he's just gotta keep putting that, that hurt on him. Keep him back, keep him pressured. Force him to miss shots. Both nades hit! Renegade still one shot. Stellar, Stellar gonna keep this up. Just moving from window to window. Oh, but he tags him. Now Renegade on the prowl. Looking for Stellar. Dives in, cleans him up. And with... He, he couldn't have timed it better. I mean, he's gonna get this OS likely for free. And on top of that, he has a three-shot snipe rifle. Make that two, because it Dude, plants one in the body of Stellar. But luckily, Stellar is able to get away. Renegade does grab overshield and is going to up the tempo here, getting right over towards top gold, but is not aware where Stellar is on top of that light post. Yeah, it's just Renegade looking unstoppable right now. The difference between first and second place in this tournament is pretty massive. First place going to go home with 10K. Second place is, what, 2,500 US, which is still something. still something good, but... 10k is what you want here and this is still winners finals oh but if grands is anything like this tony i mean renegade he's putting on a clinic against stellar of all people to be honest with you i wouldn't be surprised if this oh, is no. just or this is what's what's to come in the grand finals both of these players oh, no. have the ability to make it into grand finals as renegade drops some beautiful killing spree i would not be surprised if we see a rematch he's just too experienced he's been here time and time again I did a little 1v1 Halo 5 research to uh, any 1v1 tournaments we've had in the past, and there was a Team Beyond tournament a few years ago, 2018. Renegade was nasty back then, and he's nasty now. He's just better now. That he is. He, he's such an incredible player. And the, the amount of pressure he's able to put on you, the shots that he doesn't miss, the man doesn't use paddles or claws. So to this day, I have no idea how that's even possible. Taking heavy <laughs> damage from backing down, trying to stay alive. Nine to three lead in favor of Renegade. Still needs to make something happen here, Alex. He definitely makes a case for it, though. I got to say, with Halo 5, more than almost any FPS, you, you really want to be clawing or using paddles to, to really get a grasp of the movement. But, but Renegade, who is, you know, top five, top three, you know, he's, he's one of the best players in the game. He doesn't use any of it. He's like, screw that. I'll just kill you with my shots instead, man. He's, he's destroying Stellar by seven kills. He's got another snipe. Tony, I, I'm not going to change my prediction, but, but Stellar, like, he's got to wake up. Oh, no. He does, uh, and, and and now it's, it's it's getting a little out of reach. It's getting a little out of hand right now. Look at the clock. It's Look at the hand. scoreboard. Nothing's going in favor of Stellar at the moment. This man is not of Earth. He, he came from another planet, Tony. Who is this guy? He's an alien. He's hitting no-scope headshots. He's got six bullets. He's got OS. He's just shooting barrels, man. He doesn't even care. Renegade going to dive in. Shots into Stellar, who, who Stellar, who is... is at, at the brunt of a killing frenzy out of Renegade, I'm pretty sure if I'm Stellar, I've given up hope on game one, Tony. Yeah, he's just diving out with a challenge. It's going to be real tough. And, and what's crazy to see is that, you know, this is a manhandling by Renegade, putting on an it's absolute clinic. But well, well we, we saw what Stellar was able to do. Stellar was looking just as good as Renegade was in winners round one and two. But it just shows that, man, Renegade, is on another level that's why i picked this man to win and i'm happy i did so stellar looking like vemzy in the last series like vemzy could not do anything against renegade and it looks like maybe nobody can do anything against renegade that should be a double beat down oh. but somehow renegade backs out stellar still cleans it up 13 to 5 is not an impossible comeback to make but renegade cannot touch the snipe one one more time 
because it's definitely over if he does. The same with the OS. Like, Stellar needs to lock down everything on this map and keep playing like he's not at this massive deficit. And right now, oh, yeah, I, was I, like, I, I, I don't know. I, I respect you as a caster, one of the best analytical minds that we have in Halo, but I'm going to have to ask you that you Where never you put Stellar and Vemzy in the same sentence again and say that oh. Stellar starting to look like Vemzy. I'm going to have to ask that you never do that again. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm pulling your Halo card. I will pull your Halo card away. Hey, relax, Mr. Entitled here. Uh, <laughs> see, I'm just saying the score line is is what's the same. Like, I'm not saying they're the same level of play. I'm just saying, you know, Renegades dominate the man. That's as clear as day to me. And one more kill will seal this game out with a, with a massive performance. It's going to be 15 to 6. If he gets it, Stellar going to do anything he can to ensure this man doesn't at least go 2.0. But it's over. Yeah, he gave up, so he will take it. Yeah. 15 to 6, Tony. What what was that? Like, I mean, sure, we're, we're not comparing Stella to Renegade. We're comparing the performance in this game. And I'd say, I think Vemzy did better. Wait, actually, I don't even know. What was the, I don't remember the final score, but it was close to this. That's for sure. I, either way, I mean, uh, Renegade playing, just showing us how to play Plaza. Just straight, no, no pads and pens were out, I'm sure. Say, okay, well, he did this over here, this over here. It was absolute perfect 1v1 gameplay on plaza now we're going to see if he could replicate that in game two stellar gets to pick the exact map that he wants no no restrictions make it your best yeah, one I, I mean i doubt stellar's taking any notes if you're taking notes in this series then then it's already over you know stellar's got to stick to his game plan and and he definitely can do this he you know we've seen him hit nasty shots make nasty plays all day today he's been dominating this is the first i want to say real threat that he's faced as far as you know, everyone else has just been out of hand, I'd say. But how will he conquer this threat, Tony? I got no idea. He can he can pick crossfire, he can pick regret, but but the performance on these maps needs to be night and day different. If he wants a chance, I would say at least pick something without a sniper, and then at least you know Renegade can't can't do what he did with the sniper in the last game. I don't know if picking I don't know if picking regret is the, is the play. I'm not even too confident about uh, about crossfire. I, I say you got you got to mix things up. You got you got to throw a, a coliseum in there. Throw throw something crazy in there, Stellar, because I, I don't know if regrets to play. Renegade is a nasty regret player. Disgusting. Doesn't matter where you bring Renegade, he's gonna play well. That's for sure. Uh, Stellar, wherever you're comfortable, is just where he's got to go. Right? If it's regret, if he's comfortable, regret. Crossfire, sure. Call it, switch it up. I don't know. I doubt it though. I doubt we're going to get Truth. doubt we're going to get Kali. It's going to be between those two, likely. And we'll find out in just a second here. But what a what a game so far. It's just been a, a show from Renegade here, who, if he continues at this rate, then he'll just be sitting pretty in Grand Finals, waiting for whoever else wants to go up against him. Oh, we're not going to have to wait much longer. I'm I'm ready for this. I, I have a feel, I don't know. I have a weird feeling, Alex. I have a feeling that still, no matter what game two is going to be, I think still is going to win. I, I just have a feeling that 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 uh, that we haven't seen the best of Stellar. I think he's gonna come oh, out, no. take game number two, and and force a game three. I, and here it is. I said you oh. got you got to throw a wrench in there, and it's gonna okay. be Coliseum. I like it. Something new, you know. Give us a change of scenery. We brought us we brought ourselves to Kali here. Stellar, this is I guess his counter pick, and I hope this is a counter pick that prevails for him. There is a sniper on this map, and there is a renegade on this map. And now the Renegade has the Sniper. Tony, I'm worried. This might go horribly wrong because he already has Snipe. There's no Rockets, by the way. The Rockets are up on the map, but we're not picking them up. Sniper Rifle in the hands of Renegade trying to make his way over towards top catwalk here. Actually, and let things are back down. Stella gets a couple few shots, and I'm not mad at this. I don't know if the Rockets are going to be in play, though. I, is, I, I didn't read the rule, but no, the not. Coliseum, to be honest, I didn't, think we're gonna, I didn't think we were going to see it. <laughs> Yeah, I, I didn't expect it to even... Okay, first of all, Renegade's just getting started, and this is about to be a repeat of the last series if he doesn't shut him down quick. But but never do you use Rockets in 1v1 Kali. Uh, that's just... No, we, ne never. It's not happening. <laughs> no, no pro would agree to it. Oh, but what I do like right there is that prenade out of Stellar. That's the answer we need to see. If he's going to get in this series, if he's going to bounce back, he needs to do it quickly before Renegade gets on a tear here, and well, he still has snipe ammo to work with. So Stellar, show me why this counter, show oh. me why this counter pick was the right pick. This is what you gotta do. 
you said no pro would agree to rockets, and I don't think Renegade agreed to that nade or that sniper. Not at all. We're tied up into a piece Ooh. right now. Make that a 3 2 Let's lead go. in favor of Stellar. Literally threading the needle with that headshot. Jesus, I'm a believer. We'll keep praying. We'll see what else he can put together here. Four shots in the chamber. Renegade gonna try his hand at the same challenge. Opposite side map this time in Stellar. Just looking to peek it. Check out these clambers on the archway as well. You grab the outside of the archway, you can clamber, jump right back up to it. It's a nice quick way to get high ground and to get a, a high cha uh, challenge angle, which is what Stellar wants here. But Stellar running out of options. Though that bullet does hit its target. Now he's four to two. He's still got one shot and he's going to lock down the spawn yet again. Still on board here with Zeller, but he's not going to have that sniper rifle anymore. Burns all of the ammo that was available. Two kill lead in favor of him. I think Renegades have to make something happen. What a great prediction made by Renegades. I'm sorry, Stellar. That was an excellent follow-up nade, but doesn't get the kill. I watched Stellar play against Bound on this map. He's been practicing on this map quite a bit, and it's starting to show, that's for sure. He's holding down snipe side here. A new snipe is about to pop. And if he keeps this control in the way that he's doing, he'll grab that snipe right. as well. Though he's forced spawn Renegade over on Cave's side, and he doesn't see it yet. Now he's aware. He's just trying to make sure he's crossed the T's, dot the I's here. Renegade's waiting for the new snipe, Stellar. He's got to make sure he's looking when it comes up, though. He's just going to hold the angle from Top Cat. Oh, the challenge coming in with the nades, though. One explosion just blind him, but Stellar repeaks. Both players one shot. Needs to ice up. Wow. But the high ground will prevail, and Renegade, he's got this snipe yet again. Renegade needed that win. Luckily, he did do uh, he did do so and gets a sniper rifle larger because of it. Influences the spawn and the spawn which was red elbow. But I don't think Renegade's aware of it. He's still looking on blue side. Shots are coming in while his pants are down. What's gonna happen? <laughs> spawn knowledge definitely crucial in this one. Stellar, even though he's top rocks though, this is not good if he's only got the Magnum. Because Renegade could just look into top rocks for free, get that scope. But Renegade playing a patient. He's worried about the threat of a close range challenge here. So taking his time, checking his corners. Stellar also very clearly taking his time. Stellar might have seen him, though. He's in blue. Ready to get a pop out. He's hiding behind the podium. Stellar can see through that podium, by the way. If he crouches, I think he can see through it. I think he knows Renegade's there. He's just waiting for the opportunity. Does hit him one time. You know, re-challenge from the window. Renegade. Renegade just hits one body shot, and it's game over for Stellar. So he's got to play it so carefully. That he does, and Renegade gets right over towards Catwalk. Body oh, shots to Stellar. So Throws a great nade towards left side. Looks right, takes him down, and now only down by one kill is Renegade. You gotta be so quick and so smooth with that movement to snap on the body and then fly to the archway to get that high angle and finish off the kill. I think he connected there. Nades in, Stellar, no options. He can't move. He's gonna try to thrust out to stay up, and he can't stay up because Renegade covering every option. He's tied it, Tony. Tied up at five apiece. Renegade, four shots in the sniper rifle. J just barely whiffs that one, but throws an excellent nade. Yo, he did it again. Just like that. Takes him down. Stellar goes down, and the lead is back in favor of Renegade. Ooh, my prediction looks good right now, Alex. My prediction dude, looking good. <laughs> I mean, yeah, sure. Renegade shots insane. It's insane, dude. His shot's so clean. It's, it's driving me crazy, man. Just the fact that, so he hits that headshot, but I mean, his ability to jump out the archway and snap onto the challenge before Stellar clears the wall. Like, Stellar cannot breathe. Look, he'll do it again here. Stellar finally getting out. Renegade loses high ground here. Stellar needs to try to find a way to take advantage. But he's still got two bullets, and two bullets is a massive, massive threat when they're in the hands of Renegade. Renegade absolutely incredible with the sniper rifle. One of the best around. And Stellar, not too bad as well. I want to see Stellar take out Renegade. Maybe steal the sniper, make something happen. Sadly, Renegade burns at least one, one but only one it. left. That's the body shot going in for the head. Can Renegade oh. finish? Yes, he does. Three kill lead in favor of JW. Respect to Stellar for putting it all on that one challenge. He he went in. He was hoping that Renegade wouldn't hit the shot, but a final bullet in the chamber. Renegade succeeds, and he cleans up the kill. Stellar now in trouble once again. The prenade, beautiful out of Renegade to deny him. But Stellar rechallenge coming in. Can you get the beat down? Trade comes out. It's down to RNG, Tony. Who's going to spawn closer to Sniper? Can anybody get it for free? Or can they deny it? Can they use it as bait? This Sniper's so oh. crucial. Stellar's close to it. He might have a chance, but he doesn't want to jump right away. Look at that. An angle from bottom mid. Renegade is so freaking accurate. Tony, look at that. Look at this. He's bottom mid. 
He's... I don't... I don't get it. We gotta... Can we get, like, a Zim check or something? Is this man on PC? What's he on? R and Jesus did play a factor in that one, but Renegade was ready. He ends up getting the sniper rifle, almost hits another headshot. Stellar, wow. and there it is. A body shot comes in. Stellar goes down, and this is getting a bit out of hand here. Stellar needs to make something happen, and time may not be on his side. Oh man, he's he's not missing, dude. I'm I just uh, how do you even? All right, calm down. It's not over yet. <laughs> He needs, he needs three kills to close this, but I, my hope uh, has dwindled quite a bit here uh, on Stellar's chances, Tony. Renegade's looking way, way too good. He's still got four shots. He's Every single shot is connecting. He snapped onto the body with a no-scope there, so he's now going for the re-challenge once again. Stellar, going to try to get out to window here. You know he's going to hit it. Oh, he doesn't. Any missed shot is honestly the biggest saving grace Stellar could hope for, but this any challenge is scary on Stellar, but Stellar... Okay. He oh. does get away, but there's no snipe ammo, Tony. So nothing to work with to really bounce back. And that was good for Stellar because he really needed that kill. And he, he does know that the spawns are coming in towards back blue. Does an excellent prediction, Nate. I don't know how that didn't hit. The demon currently hiding behind the flag post. Actually going to go over towards blue elbow. I like that play. Stellar advancing forward towards blue window. Stellar needs another kill, and he needs it now. Stellar can play this patiently. Wait for that last snipe to come up and hopefully make a play with it. Just gonna keep holding down high ground, hold down snipe side. Uh, you can see uh, Renegade's actually sneaking through red. He's up on rockets now. Stanley, you gotta, you gotta get out. Oh, so, so scary. He does jump in, he doesn't have that perfect color cover. Uh, it's just, if Renegade has any opportunity and you do not, you're not ready to back out instantly, you will get killed. You, like, it's just, it's unstoppable. The man's unstoppable, Tony. You will get killed if you can't back out. And there's a, there's a reason why so these players are two of the best around. Just, it's crazy what Trade. we're seeing right now. Trades come in. Renegade right. and Stellar both being taken out, but that kind of goes in favor of Renegade, who now only needs one Sniper more kill to seconds. take this win and this series. So, Snipe's about to come up. The, the only way this can go, if Stellar wants any hope, is he has to pick up Snipe. Oh, it's over. Oh, oh, oh does he know? He got out, he's so lucky that he just didn't get back smacked there. Stellar did not know Renegade was hiding. Renegade with a cheeky play, and Stellar does win the fight. He's still breathing. So Stellar needs to play perfect and hit every shot, and he can actually do this. But he's losing ammo already. He does hit a body. He's going to re-peak. He's re-peaking with the craziest of challenges here. One kill will close it, Renegade preying on him from above. Stellar, can you hit the body? Stellar can't connect. He does! He hits a headshot, Ooh. Tony. Five kills unanswered is all or is is all he can do to get back in this. He's gotta play perfect. I mean, it's like two kills per minute. I don't even know if that's even possible, but we're going to find out. Stellar does have the snipe yeah. rifle in hands, has about two bullets, and Renegade has stopped moving. He's playing the time, and it's going to end yep. up being mathematically impossible at some point, and I think Renegade is going to be advancing forward. Two minutes left. He's playing the win. Completely fair. Understandable. Renegade has played lights out all series, and now that he's finally at a slight disadvantage here, he knows he can play the clock. Why not? You know, make this man sweat. Make him work for every kill. And he's just sitting in the back of the base. He's not even moving. <laughs> Renegade's... He's just sitting there. There's no need, Tony. I completely respect this play. Renegade has earned this this opportunity. He's earned his ability to just hide and wait and uh, and make sure he wins this. Renegade has ascended to Rena Milk. There it is. He ends up popping out, but again, I don't, I don't know if it's mathematically possible for Stella to come back. He does have one sniper bullet left, so we're going to find out if it is. We hit it. There's the body shot on Renegade, so that's going to be good. Get in there. And you got to get that kill, Stella. Oh. You got to get that oh. kill. But defeat. Wow. Those Tony, those pre nades out of Renegade, those were calculated. The bank nades off the floor that perfectly landed in the challenge angle of Stellar. He knew Stellar was going to want it, so he put the nades down and he he canceled it out completely. Came back, took the kill. Man, what a what a series! What a, just Renegade is is looking unstoppable. He's looking unbeatable. If he keeps playing like this, he wins it. I want a story though, Tony. I want a comeback story. So I believe that that Stellar can come back. He can make it happen, but it's not going to be easy. He's going to have to fight through losers to do that. Renegade, he's going to wait. 
in grand finals winner side.